Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Eric Bertram with Apex CCTV. Welcome to our video tutorial on configuring GeoVision Control Center software to connect to a GeoVision DVR. Um, I'm going to go ahead and load up Control Center. Uh, starts off looking like this. Oops, sorry. Starts off looking like this. On the top left, there's a button called Host List that pops up if you mouse over it. So we'll click that. And I get a list of all our host devices. Uh, there are four different types of device we can use here. There's a normal GeoVision DVR, a compact DVR, and this is uh, GeoVision's uh, nice new Linux-based DVRs. You should actually check them out if you get a chance. They're very nice. Uh, and then, of course, there are video servers and IP cameras, which have been out for quite a while. Uh, in this case, we're adding a host DVR, so I'm going to add it to my DVR list rather than uh, my other lists. So we'll click this and then add a host DVR. And this is really quite simple. I'm going to give it a name. This is just a human-friendly name. It doesn't have to be correct. It's just something for your reference. Uh, this address is actually either a DNS resolvable name, such as apexcctv.com, or in this case, it's going to be an IP address for our GeoVision demo. And I will go ahead and enter a username and password that I know have per permissions for this feature. I do already have all the ports uh, configured on the DVR. They're using the default, so the command port is 3388. Uh, data is 5611, and log is 5552. Uh, the DVR does have 16 cameras, and uh, so we can go ahead and click OK. And that's it. The GeoVision demo DVR is in our host list. Now I can do all kinds of things here. Uh, I can right-click a camera and do a live view to, to look at that camera. Um, I can do as many of these as I'd like. Um, we can, so we'll close that for now. I can also right-click the DVR and, and log in uh, to the remote DVR, which is literally the software interface for the DVR as though I were sitting there at the desk. Uh, so that's a great feature if you need to change your settings or your network features. Uh, all of this stuff is here and available where you can maximize a video feed and watch that and do whatever you like here, just as though you were physically sitting at the DVR. So we'll close this for now. Um, oh, sorry guys, that's the wrong software. Um, and there's a, a myriad of other features here. We can get into matrix views or um, see the inputs and outputs situations, um, log in and check services, uh, really do just about anything we want with this. So uh, we'll get into some, some of those other features on future training videos. Uh, but in this case, it's that simple. You, you uh, go to the host list, uh, select the list that you want your DVR to be in, click Add Host, click Add Host DVR, enter your settings, and voila, you're off and running. Uh, thank you so much for watching our training videos, and thank you for using Apex CCTV.